So let's look at question six. So question six uh, give us a frequency table and we also have relative frequency and we are going to uh, choose the correct bar chart and uh, pie chart. So if we look at the question part A, so which bar chart is correct. So we look at the highest bar, which is the green one. The green one represents uh, the BAs. Uh, the number of counts, let's go back to the frequency table, it has 230. And if we go back to the bar charts, the A is OK on the green bar, and the B is not correct, because this green bar is already over 400, which is too high. So B cannot be correct. Let's compare A and C. So the difference between A and C is the number of counts for PhD and MA. So if we go back to the frequency table, we know uh, there are more masters than PhDs. So A is not correct, because A in uh, A bar chart, there are more PhDs than uh, MAs. So C is the correct answer. So if we look at the, the part B question, it's about relative frequency. Uh, so if we go back to the table, we look at the relative frequencies. Still, we look at the, the highest one, which is the BA. So the percentage or the relative frequency is 44.23%. So if we go back to the three, go back to the three option, the first one is not correct because the highest bar is already over. 80. So it should be around uh, 44 according to the frequency table. So A is not correct. The B is correct, but why C, why C, C is not correct? Because this is already over 200. It cannot be correct. So C is, is wrong. So if we look at the, the part C question, so we are talking about the, the pie chart. So we know from the fr relative frequency data, so the BA has the highest relative frequency, which is about uh, 45%. So the green one should be about 44% in the pie chart. So A cannot be correct. This is way less than 44%. So A is not correct. So B, uh, so 44% is, uh, is near to half. But if we look at the B, it's still uh, less than 44%. So if it's half, we can have, we should be having half of the, the green, or nearly half of the green, but this is way less than half of the green, or uh, not equal to 44%. So C is correct. Okay. So that's uh, question number six. Let's go to the next. Okay, so question seven. So we are given a data table and there are several questions. Question A is asking, would you expect the mean purchase to be smaller than, bigger than, or about the same size of the median? So we have to look at the, this, uh, this histogram. So the histogram, if we look at the histogram, although it's uh, Roughly symmetric, but is slightly skewed to the right. Okay, skewed a little bit skewed to the right. If the histogram is skewed to the right, that means the b the, the mean should be bigger than the median. So A is correct. So how do we find the mean and how do we find the median? So let's open the uh, open the data in the stack crunch. So how do we find the mean and median? So let's go to stat, summary stats, and columns. Okay, so let's select the column of data. And under this statistics, we have the mean. Let's select the mean and also where is the median. Okay, let me select the median as well. Then let's click compute. So we get the mean and we also get the median. 